Anytime I've operated something, when I've skimped on talent, I've, that's always burned me. In other words, it's uh, they make a mistake. They you know forget to back something up. They don't have a resiliency plan in place. And if, unless I'm monitoring it and basically micromanaging them, um, I don't catch it. And suddenly we have some some outages that are occur. And I think we're seeing similar things here, even though speculating. You know, I don't know. I don't work there. I work work at Cloudflare. I don't work at AWS. I don't work at Microsoft. I'm not sure what's going on behind the scenes, but I'm just uh, assuming that something like that is going on just because of the fact of the matter is we're seeing so many so quick and in such a short period of time. So the outage be, uh, began at 6 a.m. Eastern Standard, disrupting major websites and services worldwide, uh, including uh, including Axe. Talked about that. League of Legends. Oh, my gosh. And uh, Canva. And that's what uh, what screwed me up because I had some Canva work to do today. Uh, I couldn't get that work done. Scheduled maintenance at Cloudflare's uh, uh, Santiago data center co coincided with the outage, uh, but there's no direct evidence out there that these these two events are linked. And also, there was a temporary suspension of Cloudflare's warp encryption service in London, compounded connectivity issues, suggesting multiple factors may have contributed to the disruption. And the incident really kind of underscores the risk of over centralizing internet infrastructure. We talked about that before. We saw the same sort of an impact with the AWS and Microsoft outage, where a single provider's failures can have a cascading effect uh, amongst the infrastructure out there.